Hi Torians, this is Marichi, you're my child to Loka. Just spilled water on my shirt, anyways. So I've already pulled out five cards to see what is the story for this week. You've got the Devil in Reverse as your first card. You've got the Queen of Swords in Reverse. Center of the reading is a Prince of Swords in Reverse. You've got the Death card and the Temperance. How interesting. Behind the deck is a Two of Wands in Reverse. Some of your Torians are... Um, right now might be dealing with a situation which seems very much stagnant nothing is moving forward some of you torrents might be dealing with an air sign person or somebody who feels like um very insensitive very brutal okay uh, very unfair with the way they deal with things somebody is deciding to break the chains okay somebody is it could be you as well Torians you might be deciding to break this bond which you are having it seems like it was toxic okay but um, with the two of wands behind the deck they don't see a future Okay? Within this situation, they don't see a future and they're willing to move on. Someone right now wants things to come to a complete abrupt end. Like, there is no other way around it. Just because they think two of wands, there is no future. Hmm? They are ready to break the chains with the sword which they are holding on to. Not even bothered how you want it to be. Your opinion doesn't matter. Remember, I might be speaking directly to the cross watcher, and the cross watcher is doing this to the Torians. Just flip it around, flip the genders around, flip the characters around according to your story. Abrupt ending. Okay? No communication, nothing. Just because there is a realization, even with the sun card right behind it, they are coming to a conclusion that it is over. Even I saw the six of swords. So they are going to cut the bonds, okay, with the devil card in reverse. They're going to cut the bonds, not even bothering. How the other person is going to feel about it and they are willing to move on there is a transition from here on someone is deciding to stop something and move on from this leave everything in the past and move on to have something which is much more balanced okay they don't want to be attached anymore Whatever they had with you, they don't see the future and they want to call it quits because that is the only way forward, because that is the only way things can be balanced out. For these people, okay, whoever I'm speaking to, they realize things will never move on from here. That is why they're coming out a little too cold right now. making the decision to be done with it okay i also want to add in these people are not ruthless it's just that they have processed the whole situation as it is not holding on to hopes and illusions okay when things go really bad and you're struggling to keep it together and it never seems to work out. The probability of having a future diminishes, okay? Because they don't see it manifesting. They don't see a future within the situation. So they are making the step. Like I said, realization for them, it is clear regards to how it's going to go. And they know it is not going anywhere. 
with the Prince of Swords in the center of the reading, it is like abrupt, sorry about that, it's like abrupt ending, okay, not even bother to try to make it work anymore. I also want to say they might have tried plenty of times, now we are like, the only way forward is by cutting the ties, cutting the cord with you. That was a short, simple message. All not, I'm not that happy, but yet. Seems like they are giving up. Okay? It was not easy to come to that um, decision. It was not easy for them. They might seem like a cold witch right now, but they know that is the only way that they can move on. Hmm? Okay. Like I said, the, the realization has set in regards to how the future is going to be and what are the chances to make it work, which is nil. Okay? You're moving on, putting everything in the past, again with the um, death card, transitioning into something which is much more peaceful. Hmm? Three swords. You have been pretty much hurt. Yeah. This this whole situation was stressing them out. They have been hurt so much. That is why they're coming to this decision. Hmm? They're coming through as the Queen of Wands in reverse. Very determined. Like I said, with the Queen of Swords as well. How much of it they seem uh, you know selfish, cruel. Everything. They know that is the only approach they can, you know. They have to take that energy in to make it clear that it is completely over. Hmm? You're coming out as a queen of wands who will go to any extent to make sure. Just give me a second. To make sure it's not going to work out anymore. With the three of pentacles, they're not willing to make it work. With the Eight of Cups in reverse. For me, I always speak about Eight of Cups upright. This person has separated. Okay, this person has walked away. But when it comes in uh, with the Eight of Cups in reverse, it is almost like there is no U-turn. Whoever is walking away, is intention, the intention of coming back is not there. Hmm? You're not going to work it out anymore they don't have anything much to offer anymore it is completely dead end okay two cards they're going to turn the wheel from where it is not working they're going to move on that is why the death card is there they're going to leave everything which is not working in the past and move on and uh you know just make an, a start over again because this definitely is not working some of you Torians out there might be deciding to get married with someone else. Hmm? Wow. Okay. With the half and energy. It's like starting over again and something else. Okay? Something which is solid. That's, that's crazy. Something which is not working out. Abrupt ending. It makes sense now. Okay? transitioning along with stopping something cutting the chains like making sure it is over because their intention is moving on this is what they want it almost seems like you know, they have got something big something is being offered and they did rather prefer to make that happen instead it's going to be difficult it's not an easy choice okay they have been hurt so much before trying to make this work and now they have come to the realization no no chance the world uh, the world card in reverse again it's almost like this is how it should be They're convincing themselves this is how it should be because they have already assessed the situation as it is when things do doesn't work out there's so much complex which is going on you know, back and forth energy, trying to make it work. It's a struggle. And 
somebody knows very well with the two of wands behind deck, it is never going to work out in the end. That is why we are calling it quits. Okay? They have been trying to make it work. But then, it seems like it wasn't worth, uh, it was worthless. Like, this person might have tried to make it work for so long and the other person did not put in as much effort, if that makes sense. Someone did hang in there, trying to make it work. This person is not all that ruthless. She has her own reasons for being done, like finally being done. Because she has been wronged somehow. Even when she was trying to fight and make this relationship work, It never had a chance, okay? There is an injustice, there is an unfairness about this whole thing. It's like only she put in the effort, the other person never bothered. You might have been dealing with a fire sign, or this could be you who is like watching, like observing. Like, is it even worth it to fight it when they are not even bothered? They don't even think about the future. My life is important. I need to have some kind of a stability and security. This is not going to work out. Hmm? Nine of Wands in reverse, they're not going to look back anymore. Okay? Ten of Pentacles in reverse because exactly what I was saying. The stability and the security within this relationship is, is not there. There is a realization with the Queen of Cups and the Three of Cups. It's almost like the, um, the person whom you're dealing with might have other people also in the picture. I won't go too far with it, but there is something which makes them feel very much uh, wronged. That is why we don't see the Ten of Pentacles um, happening. It's in reverse. So the security which they are seeking will never come through because of this uh, uh, third party influence. Extra people in the picture. Hmm? With the Prince of Cups and Two of Swords, it's almost like there is an immaturity. The person whom you're dealing with Okay, you might be the queen of cups and the other person is the uh, prince of cups. The ratio of how you, you get in return from this person is not good enough. You have a huge cup which you're ready to offer. But what they have to offer is a small tiny cup. There is an immaturity about this person. You might be older than this person somehow. Older than this person. There is an age difference. Or at least in the maturity level, one person seems to be mature than the other person. Who's calling it quits might be the mature, uh, like the older person or the mature person. Making a decision, okay? In regards to not moving forward with the Eight of Wands in the process of making a decision, not already, okay? But you're coming through as a fiery person who is deciding to, you know, this decision which you're coming, coming to is a very calculated one. It's not abrupt, you know? Even with the Knight of Cups, I told you, uh, Knight of Swords, I told you it's going to be abruptly ended. But when you came to this decision, you have already thought about it for some time. Okay, you might seem a little cruel right now doing this to the other person because they won't understand. But you need to do that. You know you need to do that because you don't see this coming through. Okay? You have waited so long. 
with a false energy you have waited you have paused your life for too long waiting for the ships to come through waiting for things to happen yet it never did all you did was wait okay there didn't seem to anything come out of it how much ever you paused your life hoping this person will give you what you seeked within this relationship give you that stability but this person seems to be all over the place somehow hmm? you always thought okay this person would be the one this person can be the emperor you had this hope because it is not like you know this relationship did not happen just like in last month no this has been going on for some time like probably 3 years or something you have invested so much in this person expecting something solid okay this was your instincts like uh, you know within yourself you thought this person could be the one the one <sighs> yeah amongst the others there is no competition the position is filled by this person and you did not bother about anybody else but when i spoke about the hierophant and the marriage it's like you were wrong about at least now you think you were wrong about everything you thought about this person this person would never be able to give what you want okay that clarity has come through and you want to get out of this situation okay this five pentacles situation you want to get out of it and as i said no i didn't say it. yeah to transition i do a couple of readings together so it gets a little mixed up thinking probably um i think in the previous uh, previous reading we had a world and a uh, wheel card anyways Five Pentacles, you want to get out of this situation where you feel stranded and nothing is going to work out according to your plan. You want to transition from this phase and leave everything in the past which was not working out with the Prince of Pentacles in reverse. Was that fast enough? Um, this is always like a dead horse to me. There is no way you're going to kick this um, horse to get up, uh, get up and gallop away. No. There is not much hope in this situation and you're realizing the fact with the ace of passwords okay but yet also you look like the queen of swords in reverse okay you're coming out like the cruella um very bitch mode okay cutting off everything what you have worked on okay what you two had together but within yourself you have this heart which aches for this person which aches for what you had together you're still looking at this cup okay what you had together it's like the memories you're holding on to the memories four of pentacles you're holding on to that it's like it's within you but it doesn't show on your face when you decide to cut it because you know this is the only way you know for their sake as well for their sake otherwise it's going to go around and circle and circle you know that horse thingy uh, I don't know what is it called in the fair and all there is this horses like which goes around in circle you climb on it, it never stops, it goes around in circle. It feels like that. I need to find out what's the name of that thing. Carousel. Thank you. I never expected it to come through that easily. Okay. You feel like you're going around in a carousel, which goes around and around and around, never stops. That's how your relationship has been so far. That is why you want to cut it out and move on okay with the prince of swords so you need to you know chop it out and move on from there to have a balance to have a peace in your life 
<sighs> With the alchemist in reverse. We'll have to take. Some of you might be dealing with an air sign, probably a Gemini. With the Queen, the Prince of Swords, and now the Alchemist in reverse. A strong element of air sign. Hmm? Alchemist in reverse is somebody who will play it. Okay? Maybe this is a person whom you were dealing with. Okay, just give me a second. It's almost like you have to play your cards right. Okay, to be done with it. You cannot show. I got a little distracted earlier. You have to show, uh, you cannot show what is within you, how you feel for this person anymore. Because you had, uh, so much time together you invested so much time together that it's not easy to just you know block it no it will stay with you the memories will stay with you you will hold on to it also you might come out as this cold bitch but no you're willing to be done with this break down everything you have invested on building up okay it is it is a very shaky foundation. You're willing to collapse it. Okay? Because it's not working. According to your plan. Okay? With the Ten of Cups, you never see the potential in this happening. Into this beautiful portrait. Having a family, children, dogs, etc. Yeah? A beautiful house together. You don't see that happening because it's in reverse. Case of Cups is draining out. Now you, it's almost like you had it once upon a time. You can hold on to this person, but now everything you had has drained out. I think I'll stop here. This is Marishi, you're my channel, Shiloka. Until next week, bye.